the ancient text narrates in the beginning man was created as lords in the image and likeness of the self-existent and will self-existent but by one act of identity codependency by virtue of an external point of comparison they surrendered their lordship and enslaved themselves by pneumatologically comparing and measuring themselves against the very creations that they were made to exercise lordship over the result existential dysfunction this is the human condition identity and self-validation by virtue of external points of comparison it is now millenniums later and the ancient text continues to speak in reverberating echoes as we look around and see the endless and all subjective points of comparison plaguing the human experience in their desperate and never-ending war against others reflecting their internal struggle to validate their elected identity in some cases even to the point of violently taking lives we see this codependent identity with money social status racism sexual orientation gender empowerment religion nationality just to name a few among the myriads historically speaking the only person that addressed the human condition of identity codependency with the solution is yeshua the messiah known in the western world as jesus the christ his demonstration and teachings of life via the fundamental law of the self-existent were an exemplification of what it is like to be existentially functional man again like the sun you were intended to live self-existent subscribe and follow the zain k kitura international institute of pneumatology to learn more about self-existent living this is a production of the Zain Kai Ketura International Institute of Pneumatology. Zain Kai Ketura International Institute of Pneumatology is a crowdfunded non-profit online institute dedicated to the pragmatic and experimental research, as well as education, on the energetic physics of the Holy Spirit of Christ, and inadvertently the energetic physics of all spirit. Visit us online at www.internationalinstituteofpneumatology.com.